Hey there, Civ fans! Welcome to the developer video for DLC 4. We're going to be announcing a new civilization, new game mode, and some of the other new additions you can expect to find while you're taking one more turn in the Civilization 6 New Frontier Pass. First off, the moment you've all been waiting for, the next Civ is Babylon. Babylon is a Civ we just couldn't bear to leave out. While we're going to let the upcoming First Look video give you all the details, we can say that Babylon is going to be blinding you with science! And then some. The Babylon pack will also contain a full slate of six new city-states, one of each type, each with its own unique perks, such as unique improvements for suzerains. This pack also introduces 24 new great people. We'll be introducing some familiar names like the poet Rumi and the anthropologist Margaret Mead, as well as some less familiar or underrepresented figures we think you'll really enjoy discovering. The Babylon pack also includes another optional topping for your Civilization Sunday, the new game mode Heroes and Legends. This mode introduces legendary figures from a variety of the world's cultural traditions as playable characters in the game. The new heroes are like great people on steroids, if great people could be recalled and reborn to be used again and again. Each hero has their own unique abilities based on stories from myth and history. Recruiting these heroes can propel your civilization to new heights of prosperity, innovation, and military might. As with our great people, we'll be featuring some familiar heroes, as well as some names that might be more obscure, depending on where you hail from. One of the most recognizable heroes in the game mode is none other than the legendary knight, wielder of Excalibur, King Arthur himself. His primary ability, Arthur's Accolade, transforms an adjacent military unit into a questing knight, a unique heavy cavalry unit with increased combat strength and greatly increased lifespan. Other heroes you may recognize include Hercules, Beowulf, and the Polynesian demigod, Maui. Some perhaps less familiar heroes include Himiko, the Japanese shaman queen, Oya, the Yoruba Orisha of storms, death, and rebirth, and the mythical Mayan twins Hunapu and Ishpalanke, who resurrect the enemy land units they slay so they can fight again under your control. You can discover heroes as you explore the map, engage in city-state diplomacy, or undertake the Heroic Tales city project in one of your cities. Once you discover a hero with abilities that complement your goals and playstyle, you can recruit them by performing a devotion project at any completed monument. Just beware, other civs might be after the same hero. Like world wonders or great people, heroes are unique and can only belong to one civilization each game. The first time a hero dies or expires, they leave behind two heroic relic great works, an epic and a symbolic object. These relics provide buffs throughout the rest of the game. Monuments can display these items in two new heroic relic slots. In short, the Babylon pack is all about the power of personality. 24 new great people, a slate of legendary heroes, and even Babylon's leader was known for their charisma. Especially if we think of charisma as it is in tabletop RPGs, as a kind of force of personality. The DLC 4 Babylon pack will be available on November 19th. Civ fans, you are the best fans in gaming. We hope you stay safe, healthy, and happy throughout the coming winter season. We'll see you in December in the video for our next free game update to keep you entertained during the sleet or snow or sunshine or whatever December may bring in your part of the world while you're taking one more turn.